Rugby league has been a huge turning point for me in my life. I was very lost. I've always been very lost. I've just not, never known my place in the world. I first started in athletics at nine years old and at age 12 set the European age best performance for a 12 year old over 60 metres, um, a record that still stands. I think definitely chasing the ice cream truck down the road uh, helped, helped me out getting my, my speed in as a youngster. So you started out in sprinting and then you decided, a bit like the film Cool Runnings, that you were going to take to the ice and, and become a bobsledder. Contrary to popular belief, I don't sit in a bathtub and uh, I don't have a lucky egg, but I'd always told everyone I'm going to the Olympics. And it was a, it was a fantastic experience, but it wasn't necessarily the experience that you see um, when you're watching the Olympics on TV. I was privy to, to the, the pressure and the politics and, and all those things that go along with the sport. When you get sucked into um, the world-class environment, your self-worth is attributed to hundreds and tenths of seconds and you lose a little bit of touch with reality. Um, and actually transferring um, out of such an individual sport and a, and, and a high-performance sport into a team sport, which I'm now in, with, uh, with Warrington Wolves and, and doing rugby league. I've got that love for sport and that culture and that family backing again, which is, which is I think, what was, what was actually missing when I was at the Games. We've got our, our head coach, Lee Westwood, and Super Benny Westwood, who are part of our coaching staff. But they're almost like um, an, another uh, father figure as well to the girls. And I think they've really done well with the relationship that they've built with all of us. Um, to get to know us all as individuals. And often that's, that's the difficulty in sport, because you're seen for your talent, but you're not seen for who you are as a person. Well, we got our uh, heritage numbers last year. Um, so I am now number 13 for the Warrington Wolves women. And that will stay with me and stay with the club now, moving forwards. To think that six years ago, I was in um, a full bodysuit of lycra, and just responsible for how fast I could run and jump in a sled. To now running out on a pitch and, um, you know, you've got, you've got your boots on and you've got your shirt on with your name on the back and, and you're representing something that's so much bigger than just you. It's a really exciting time for women in the world. Um, and I think if we can all uh, get the culture right and... Um, and, and not be afraid to talk about some of the issues like mental health and, um, and, and like some of the, the confidence issues, um, then you know, we'll, we will be in a really good place moving forwards.